this video. Now today I want to talk about something that I got curious about when I was thinking back on the old Animal Crossing spin-offs, is the idea of foreshadowing of New Horizons. What I mean is that I believe the Welcome Amiibo update and Happy Home Designer and Amiibo Festival all gave us little bits of foreshadowing of what we're going to see in Animal Crossing New Horizons. Now let me just point out, Animal Crossing New Leaf came out June 9th, 2013 in North America. But in Japan, it came out in November 2012. With Animal Crossing New Horizons coming out March 20, 2020, that means that we have waited seven years here where I live, but in the whole world, a total of eight years since the last Animal Crossing game hit the shelves. That's the longest wait we've ever had for a new Animal Crossing installment. Animal Crossing Happy Home Designer came out July 30th, 2015. Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival came out November 2015. And Animal Crossing Welcome Amiibo Update came out November 2nd, 2016. Now Animal Crossing Happy Home Designer introduced half spaces and placing furniture outside. I feel as though Nintendo was trying to figure out these features that they were planning on putting into the next Animal Crossing game for New Horizons. Now Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival. Here's an idea that has been surfing around the internet here and there, but I truly believe it might have some truth to it. I believe in the possibility that Animal Crossing New Horizons was meant to be on Wii U, but was moved over to Switch with the failure of the Wii U. This meant that they had all the things that they had created for the next Animal Crossing being an HD version and nothing to put it into. And so they decided to make Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival. It's most likely the game nobody really cares for because they just took the assets they had and shoved them all together as quickly as they could to make a game in order to continue working and pretty much start over on Animal Crossing New Horizons. This could be the reason why we have to wait so long for New Horizons to come out because they had to start over part of the way through their work. Now another little thing I'd like to point out that I don't think a lot of people have talked about yet is the Animal Crossing Welcome Amiibo update. Now in it, there was a game called Animal Crossing Deserted Island Escape. I believe that this was a huge foreshadowing of Animal Crossing New Horizons, as it introduced a deserted island theme and crafting of tools. Crazy coincidence, huh? Well, tell me your thoughts in the comments section below. Thank you so much for watching and subscribe for more Animal Crossing content weekly. Well, thank you for watching. Love y'all. Bye.